muscular system. The human body has about 640 muscles. They account for about two-fifths of our body weight. Use some 20% of our energy and most importantly control the way we move. Lying in bands just beneath the surface of the skin, muscles work together all the time. Whether we are playing games, reading, walking or writing, some muscles are always working. The more a muscle works, the stronger it becomes. This is why people who regularly work out at the gym have a far more defined muscle tone than people who do not exercise. There are three types of muscles in your body. Skeletal muscles are used to move all parts of your body. Visceral muscle is found in your internal organs such as your stomach, lungs, and intestines as well as in your large blood vessels. It is also called involuntary muscle as you can't control its movements. The walls of your heart are made of a specialized muscle called cardiac muscle which keeps contracting for all of your life. Most of the muscles in your body are called skeletal muscles and these are the muscles that you use to move. There are 640 skeletal muscles that help you do everything from walking to blinking your eyes. Cardiac muscle is only found in the heart. It would be impossible to count visceral muscles because they are shaped in layers, sheets, bags and tubes and are found inside your organs. All muscles are made up of fibers. Skeletal muscles are attached to bones and can only contract or get shorter because they can only pull and not push. Muscles usually work in pairs. One muscle moves a bone in one direction and its partner pulls it back again. When you want to move, your brain sends messages to the correct muscles, telling them to contract. This makes your muscles shorter and pulls the bones with them, causing you to move. You might think that the strongest muscle in your body is in your bottom or your legs. But in fact, it is the masseter muscle which is found on either side of your jaw that is the most powerful in your body. They move your jaw and are used for biting and chewing food. The biggest muscle in your body is the gluteus maximus in your bottom. You use this muscle to run, jump and walk upstairs. It is also a very useful cushion for sitting on. The smallest muscle is the stapedius which is attached to the tiny stirrup bone in your inner ear. When you do a lot of exercise, your muscles need a lot more energy to work properly. This energy produces lactic acid which your body cannot dispose of quickly enough. This acid damages the muscle fibers leading to an aching feeling. Luckily, the damage is not permanent and the muscle soon recovers. However, too much lactic acid will eventually stop your muscles working, which is one of the reasons that exhausted marathon runners can collapse. Muscles in your eyelids can make you blink up to 5 times a second. Types of Muscles Skeletal Muscles They hold the bones together and give the body its shape. Smooth Muscles They help different organs and tissues to perform different tasks. Cardiac Muscles They contract and relax to make the heart work. The longest muscle of a body is the 
serratorius muscle it starts from the hip and extends to the knee one of the strongest muscles is the jaw muscle other strong muscles gluteus maximus located in the buttocks and the tongue muscles the longest and the strongest tendon is the achilles tendon in the heel how muscles work muscles often work in pairs for example one muscle the biceps bends your arms and another the triceps straightens it when we smile we use 17 facial muscles and while frowning we use 43 muscles muscles are attached to the bones by tendons working together muscles bones and joints act as levers giving us a wide range of movements hands can make more movements than any other part of our body do you know over 30 muscles hold together the 27 bones of our hand allowing us to pick up something as delicate as an egg without breaking it hold your right arm out in front of you with your palm up now with your left hand gently squeeze your upper right arm do you feel a muscle no now with your left hand still on your upper right arm make a fist with your right hand and bend your right arm did you feel the muscle this muscle is called the bicep 